Starting at the gateway, a linear AS interface segment can be up to 100 meters long. The segment must be powered using exactly one AS interface power supply. Using a repeater, a second segment can be added. Don't forget the power supply. If an even longer network is required, another repeater can be used, adding yet another segment. This is a valid 300 meter linear network. To simplify the drawings, we will assume power supplies to be present but will no longer show them. Let's start with a linear network and add a repeater here. This is allowed as long as the first segment containing the gateway is no more than 100 meter long. Using this approach, it is possible to set up a five segment network with 500 meter length. Note that the gateway now sits in the middle of the network. The underlying rule is that no module must be more than two repeaters from the gateway. Now imagine a 100 meter linear segment where the cable has twice the cross section of the AS interface cable. Next envision pulling this cable apart. Electrically speaking, you have not changed anything, but from a topology point of view, you created a 200 meter ring shaped network. Some users like ring shaped networks mainly because they add a level of redundancy. The fact that such a ring can have a total length of up to 200 meters may be an advantage in some other cases. By placing the repeater as shown, that is outside of the ring itself, additional rings can be added. Applying the no module must be more than two repeaters from the gateway rule results in a network with up to 1000 meter total length. Placing the repeater inside the ring as shown here is not allowed. In summary, here are the possible and forbidden networks, as well as the rules to remember.